We took game one in Philadelphia. Things looked promising. An eight seed having a lead over the one seed, especially on the road. Game two came along. I thought we had it. It came down to the wire. The Sixers walked away with the victory, though. And they tied the series. But now the next two games are headed to Madison Square Garden. Can we get another lead against the Sixers and potentially upset them in the first round and beat them in the whole series? League leaders in the playoffs, my oh my, look at Kevin Durant going off for the Brooklyn Nets. About 41 and a half points per game, followed by Anthony Davis putting the Lakers on his back. Curry, Harden, looks like Cat is out for the season with a broken left ankle. That is tough. Where is LaMelo Ball? There he is, 26 and a half points per game, averaging 10 assists in the playoffs as well. Where is he ranked there? He's third in the league assist-wise. And looking around the league, the Lakers and the Rockets are actually tied. Wait, the Lakers are an 8 seed? I just realized that. They are tied with the one seed of Rockets. The Warriors are taking care of this new look Grizzlies squad. Mavericks taking control over the Timberwolves, who of course are missing Cat with that broken left ankle. The Pelicans, 2-0 lead over the Clippers. Interesting, of course, we're tied up right here. The Nets, 3-0 lead over the Magic. The Wizards somehow snuck into the playoffs and have a 2-1 lead over the Celtics. And the Miami Heat have a 2-1 lead over the two-seeded Bucks. So game three coming right up. I'm not going to lie. The Knicks have been playing beautiful so far in the playoffs. My teammates have actually been stepping up. The question is, can they do it consistently before I do hop into game three? Any newcomers to the channel would mean a lot to me if you hit that subscribe button and hit that video notifications bell. And if you do end up enjoying the video at any point, a thumbs up does help me out a lot and would also be greatly appreciated. 1500 likes is the goal. And now the comment of the previous episode. Nick's big man gets a mismatch in the post. Also Nick's big man takes a fadeaway jumper instead of just bodying him down low for the easy hook or layup. I swear bro, the IQ of my big men is like negative. They don't take the mismatches properly. So thank you, that is the comment, the previous episode, if you want me to comment on this episode, comment something funny relating to the video, you'll get pinned and featured in the next episode, but without further ado, Game 3, we are in MSG this time, can we take a lead over the Philadelphia 76ers, let's find out. David, I'll look at the 76ers starting group, the tall lineup out there for the 76ers, Simmons, Richardson, Harris, Horford, and MB, and for New York. Barrett and Knox are the wingmen. It's Randall and Robinson at the four and the five. And it's Ball in at the one spot. Here we go. These Knicks fans have not seen a home playoff game in a while. Let's make them go home happy. Let's win this game. It's going to Ben. It's going to be a steal. Give me that. Oh, my gosh. Didn't give me the good animation there. Mitch, help me out. Mitch, help me out. Great defense. We forced the miss. That bronze intimidator coming to use. We see Knox down the court. Can he go baseline? Knox getting me assists. I love it. Oh, Randall. Position on Horford. That's two early assists for LaMelo. He's just taking what the defense gives him. Knicks fans have cutouts of LaMelo. You love to see it. Give me that steal. Timed it perfectly. Randall, keep going. Or my pop. Nope. Randall has position again. Three assists early. Randall setting the screen. Oh, I got the space. Wide open LaMelo from deep. The range extender right there. He's doing a little bit of everything. And I'm going to keep my meter on for this game. I think I'm just going to alternate on and off between games. Strip. Oh. Good strip. Look at Knox. Knox's defense. Look at Kevin Knox, baby. Dude, Knox in the regular season versus Knox in the playoffs. Two completely different players. Randall with the screen. Ben Simmons goes under. Ben Simmons, you should not go underneath the screens. What is wrong with you? I read this play. I know Tobias is going to slide up. I'll see Ben Simmons. Not worried about that, though. He's going baseline. Beautiful defense, and he gets the board, and we have the fast break. Knox, find me. I got position. Can he fit the pass through? Yes, he could. Look at Kevin Knox. Draw the charge. Wow. Oh, great 
Hundred percent. Okay, dude. Really, 2K? You're not gonna reward us for a great defense. Find me, RJ, on the cut. The layup is good. I thought they were gonna give me a long animation and let him be blocked. No, we got it to go. Double screen. Will it free me up? I have the space for three. It's not green. It goes again. We need to green those though, but that flexible release coming to use. Another three pointer. Jermichael, I want you to fade. There you go. Or you can swing one more to RJ. Beautiful ball movement. RJ, you got to shoot that. Now we got three seconds. Knox puts it up. Knox! Kevin Knox! All right, we sub out. It's a tie game. And the bench lets me down, of course. We're down by eight. All right, Jeremy Lin's in the game. Oh, they got Zaire back on. Oh, what a move by LaMelo. Green light on Zaire Smith, who's a beautiful defender. No way. Good D, Randall. Let's go. We got to push this. Find me. I got no one in my path. Strong take by LaMelo. 18 quick points, and all of a sudden, it's a three-point game. This man is really a game changer. Beautiful. I'm pulling that. I'm LaMelo Ball. Oh, in and out. That was halfway down the rim. Lynn pulls that. I'm in his face. Let's go. Find me. I'm taking this. Off. Randall, you got to give me the ball. Randall, keep cutting. Oh, Randall didn't cut. Oh, Mitch has the mismatch, but you already know what happens during mismatches. We don't get a bucket. Look at Mitch. Oh, my goodness. You know, it's not the biggest mismatch, but it's still a mismatch. Give me that block. Look at the help from LaMelo. Knox. Big shot, Knox. It's a green. Yo, Kevin Knox is my new favorite teammate. Oh, and beat the point guard again. Last time that happened, he got a bucket. Oh, I got knocked down by the screen. Beautiful screen. Beautiful defense. Recover. Beautiful contest. 11%. You're out of your mind. That's at least 70% contested. Let me post up Zaire. You gotta get out of my way, Knox. You know what? Knox, put it up. You're open. Look at Kevin Knox! Dude, he has like three out of my five assists. Randall's the other two, but it feels like he has 20 assists for me. Mitch with the beautiful screen. Lamelo step back mid-range green. Not even Zaire could guard that. We got our sharp takeover. It's looking slow for the Sixers. Oh boy, they need a timeout. They got a game plan for this. Beautiful defense on Jay Rich. Dude, how is that 29% covered, dude? These numbers are not consistent. It's okay. I got my takeover. They have the double. We see Trier. Look at this vision. Trier, best sharpshooter in the league. He leads the league in three-point percentage. Misses that one. Of course he would. Let's go. Mitch sent me a good one. We need the separation. They're playing the three-pointer. One more, Jamichael. Oh, back outside. Lamelo has the space. Green light. Even a sliver of space is too much for LaMelo. There's a three right there. Good strip. We're on the break. Find me, Knox. Oh, Zaire really recovered. Hop step. One more. Trier in the corner again. He's going to green this one. Oh, my gosh. Look at that defense. Our communication is just different. I see Knox. But he got... Oh my goodness, bro. The vision is different. This first half is beautiful right here by the Knicks. Except we're only up by one. It feels like we should be up by more. Can we sub out rest of the half? Yes, let's go, bench. We are up by three at halftime. We're not going to start the second half neither, so let's see what the bench does there. All right, we don't start the second half? All right, all right. We're up by two, but basically up one because Embiid's at the line. We had 24 first half points. In honor to Kobe. Beautiful screen by Randall. Freeze up the lane. They're going to help off Knox. Knox is going to bobble the ball. Take the mid-range. Miss it. I get the board. Pump fake works. And one! That's on Ben Simmons. The game has been very close in a lot of areas. The rebounding has been the one differential. Oh, come on. Let me steal that. Reward my timing. Ben Simmons just dribbling the ball for days. Finally passes it off. Now he's in the post. Give me some help. 
I all I did was hold the rice stick up. I played hands up defense there. Ben Simmons draws the foul. That's the best defense I could play. Horford has a mismatch. We're not letting him get the ball, though. We're completely disregarding Ben Simmons. Look, their offense is stagnant right now. 30% cover. No one's out of the board. And, oh my goodness, Mitch. You just got posted by Al Horford. Beautiful screen from Mitch. Mitch, keep rolling. Mitch, relax. We already know you cannot make a layup for your life. Beautiful spin. Step back. Lamelo for three. Bounce back release in and out. In and oh Mitch, you gotta get Mitch, you gotta help him out. What is that transition defense? I'm helping on the screen. Three seconds, two, one. Terrible shot. Get the board. What just happened? Why did I secure the board? Why didn't anybody secure the board? That's just some garbage, bro. That is frustrating. Mitch sent me the screen. Pump fake. Okay, nothing's there. Randall, beautiful. Randall, you're wide open. You should. He was going to pack it down on JaVale, dude. He should have just took the mid range. Ben has takeover. Can we get a stop here? Because they've been scoring on every possession so far. Oh my gosh, I'm kind of scared. We're doubling. We're doubling. They're not doubling. Help me out. Yo, I'm, no way, dude. All right, dude. That's the shot we'll let him take. Randall, find me. Knox, take it all the way. I believe in you, Knox, with the slam. That's a double-double. Dude, Ben is isolated. Someone help me. Dude, it's so glitchy. You can't guard him. He just phases through you like he did right there. Did we really just allow that? Dude, I give credit to my teammates, but sometimes my teammates, bro, they're just, their IQ just drops all of a sudden. I want the screen from Chris. There it is. Chris has the mismatch. Feed Chris the ball. Feed him the ball. Dude, give Chris the ball and put it up. There is it. There it is. The fadeaway. Oh my gosh, they made a fadeaway. That's literally the comment of the episode. Taking a fadeaway with the mismatch. Except that time they made it. Three, two, one. He doesn't have time to shoot. He does have time. Get the... Dude. Get Chris out the game. I, I'm sorry, bro. Get Mitch in the game. We can't get a board without Mitch. Tobias mid-range off the mark. I guess I have to rebound myself. I have to rebound myself. Chris, keep going. Chris. Yeah, Chris, dude. You got to get out of here, bro. Oh, boy. We saw about... <gasps> Yo, no. We are up by eight. Dude, stop. Guard Ben. Guard Ben. We strip Ben. RJ, one more to LaMelo. This just made me so happy. We're up by 10 right now. Let me strip. Oh, we do strip him. Can't get the ball, though. Embiid missed the slam. Look at RJ. RJ, big shot. Take your time. It's a green. They're doubling. Who's going to be open? All right, Jermichael, take your time. Take the layup. Not the brightest double team right there, but let's just pick apart those double teams if they're going to do it every possession. Look at Knox's defense, bro. Knox, dude, Knox, you're a great player. Find me, Knox. One more. One more to Mitch. Beautiful pass. Finish. Let's go. Let's go, man. We're in great position. Step all oh, range extender. That's very deep. That's not... Okay, we don't have Hall of Fame range extender, but look at Mitch. I love him. Oh, Ben Simmons full steam down the court. You can't stop that. Good help, though. Oh, we're down the court. We got position. We got to take this all the way. Beautiful hop and slam. We did it. We got it done. 14-point victory in game three. We have a lead over the one seed. Unfortunately, we didn't win by 15. We won by 14. If we won by 15, we would have got another badge upgrade. But a win's a win. Game four now, riding that high after this win. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For Clark Oh, all right. Oh, my good. First of all, let's look at LaMelo's stats. 32 minutes, 33 points, 5 boards, 6 assists, a steal, and a block. Efficient shooting. And then look at my boy Kevin Knox. 32 points. Unefficient shooting. 
My boy, Knox right here, RJ and 19, Trier had 12. That's what I like to see. Mitch with the 15 boards. That's why, that's why he's on the team. Ben Simmons actually had 37 and 10. And beat at 21. We got it done, man. How many badge upgrades is that? 20 plus, that's one. 10 plus assists, that's two. Double, double, that's three. 50% from the field goal, that's four. Not quite 50% from three. And if only we won by 15 plus, we would have five. But we have four badge upgrades after this performance. Let's go, baby. 2-1 lead over the Sixers. We did win this game. We're going to triple the stats. We also did shoot efficiently, so we should get a decent amount of experience points from this victory. Let's see how much we get. And we did, of course, win the game with these numbers. 3.1k experience points. I'll gladly take that. So with that 3k, we have. I want to upgrade one of these badges finally because we need it. Trust me, the limitless range is 4k. But I was thinking more something along the lines of Dimer. This will help us out a lot because we do need our teammates to step up. We don't have anything near the requirements. That's a tough scene. We need an 80 passing accuracy with an 87 passing IQ to make a silver dimer. I mean, let's guess. I guess upgrade our passing accuracy to an 80 and passing IQ to as much as we could, even though this doesn't affect gameplay whatsoever. Really. We are like 70 experience points off from getting it. To an 87 even though we couldn't upgrade the badge because we still need 2k experience points with the requirements to upgrade it to a silver kind of disappointed about that but i mean i'll take it all right so four badge upgrades remember we can't upgrade the badges that are in the program we can only upgrade the new 2k20 badges and we have four of them let's see what we should upgrade flexible release silver i mean gold would help us out a lot because lamello's release kind of unorthodox kind of weird and yeah, we're not going to be greening it a lot, so flexible release will help us. That's one. Three more to go. Volume shooter will help us out a lot. We do take a lot of shots in the game. Let's make volume shooter into a gold. So we got one more upgrade. And let's make downhill from a bronze to a silver. This will speed us up on the fast break, which will help us out a lot. There are our four badge upgrades. I have, dude, I feel pretty good after these upgrades. These will help us out a lot unbelievable a 2-1 series lead over the Sixers in this game I'm not gonna lie thanks to that bench the fourth quarter performance from the bench I subbed in with an eight point lead was not expecting that at all it looks like winner of the series will take on Kevin Durant Kyrie Irving and the Brooklyn Nets so another challenge ahead for whoever wins this series Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching this episode. This was a great one. A big victory for us, dude. Kevin Knox, my new favorite player. I, I know I bashed him in the regular season for selling, but no, playoffs, he's a different animal. Oh my goodness, 2-1 series lead against the one-seeded Sixers. They're actually a tough 2K team, too, because, you know, Ben Simmons kind of glitchy. But if you guys enjoyed, leave a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Turn on that bell. Hope to see you in the next episode. But until then, I'm out. Thank you.